Wahaha! Welcome to Inktober, day number 31, and this is a piece I'm calling Seer. So this is the last day of the Inktober videos, and I'm just glad that I got through it, and <laughs> I just want to thank you guys so much for sticking around through all the ups and the downs that kind of happened during this daily video series. Um, it was just a nightmare and then I got behind and all that stuff, but I'm gonna be really sad because I really enjoyed doing it and I love saying wahaha in the beginning, so I'm gonna miss that, but um, thank you again for sticking around. I really appreciate it and I hope you've enjoyed this whole series and maybe we'll do it again next year. Who knows? So this piece is heavily inspired by a Netflix, it's not originally on Netflix, but I watched it on Netflix show called Salem and I really enjoyed it. It was great and this is kind of inspired by that and honestly I just love the concept. A lot of these Inktober pieces I really liked the concepts and I may revisit them in the future. Uh, I probably won't redo them anytime soon but you know maybe eventually. So if you want an Inktober art book, um, they are still available for pre-order and will be till November 20th. If you pre-order one, uh, you get a set of Killer Boyfriend's buttons, plus you get a print, so yay for that. Uh, I will leave a link on the screen to where you can go pre-order. Um, I cannot wait to make them. They're going to have 24 pages of lovely, amazing inktober -y goodness, and I'm just super excited to uh, send them out. I've got a few pre-orders, and I cannot wait to send them to you guys. I'm just really excited. Speaking of the Killer Boyfriends buttons, you can also pre-order those, but not as buttons. You can pre-order them as charms. Buttons are exclusive to the Inktober art book. Um, if you really like scary movies and you like the killers from the scary movies, I feel like you'd be interested in these Killer Boyfriends buttons. So this piece, um, basically this lady is a seer and she is in a graveyard and she is surrounded by ravens. They plucked her eye out, but she does have an eye on both her hands. One's on the palm and one is on the back of her hand. So it's a little morbid, <laughs> but um, it, like I said, it is heavily inspired from a TV series that I really liked and I'm very sad that it got canceled, but all in all, um, it was good and I would suggest you watch it. If you like witches, uh, I would suggest you watch it. However, it's not for young people. Um, it is very uh, morbid. It is very um, gruesome and it is it's kind of different so um, if you're under 18 or actually probably under 16 I'd say I probably wouldn't watch it um, but you know if you're into that sort of stuff yeah I don't know just don't I don't want to get you in trouble so don't don't get in trouble <laughs> also don't scar yourself for life I did that and it's not fun anyway that is another story for another video so uh, if you're not already and you want to be a supporter over on patreon to help support the channel uh, I will leave a link on the screen um, it really helps support the channel almost every penny I get from any money I make uh, on this channel and on patreon goes right back into the channel I buy art supplies with it um, I do raffles and giveaways and stuff like that with it so if you want to enter a new month has started so art raffles are available again and I will be uploading a picture for the coloring contest if you color it or if you just enter the art raffle by pledging a dollar um, then you get free art stuff and who doesn't like free art stuff so uh, enter that both of them you only have to pledge a minimum of one dollar but if you pledge more you get better rewards so what's not to love about that I'd appreciate any support, and if you can't support, that's okay too. Just by watching my videos, you guys support me, and it makes me really happy. And here's a look at the final piece of the final piece. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the Inktober series, leave a like on the video. Also, if you are already and you want to be a part of our cute little squid pod, there's a subscribe button down below. And until the next time I make a video, which probably won't be till next Monday, to the live!